Former Houston Rocket Clyde Drexler on hand to watch the Rio Grande Valley Vipers try to stave off elimination against the Bakersfield Jam. And he had a little help as the Rockets invited the Red Rowdies into town. But it was the Bakersfield Jam looking for the sweep as Jeremy Wise comes up with a steal and the two-handed flush as they took a 12-4 lead in the early moments. But the Vipers would answer back. New acquisition on assignment from Houston. Marcus Kuzan with a big jumper there. And then... The Vipers with a beautiful defensive play here from Richard Rovey, stealing it out of midair, taking it to the hoop, getting the harm as well as the Vipers gain the lead in the second quarter. Then it's Jarrell McNeil taking over, left corner jumper for three. Then this time from the right wing, he had five three-pointers on the night and had a game-high 26 points. Then Bakersfield answering back, trying to get back into this one, tying the game at 60 was number 32, Derek Byers. He had 14 points on the night for the jam. Then Matt Janning was reigning in from downtown. Launches this one from the right wing. Then with good ball movement, Vipers send it around again, dialing in from long distance is Janning. He also had five three-pointers and finished with 17 points. Then with the jam, trying to keep it close in the fourth, Arenze Onuwaku slams it home like a volleyball, says, I don't think so. Vipers go on to win 104-92, to staving off elimination from the Bakersfield jam, forcing a deciding game three in the quarterfinals tomorrow at State Farm Arena. This is the NBA Development League on FutureCast.